Good evening, my friends. I'm Nero, and welcome back. We'll start gameplay here shortly. Um, start with a bit of a disclaimer. I am very tired, and I don't have much of a voice. I will try to continue my banter through this chapter, but uh, it might not be the highest quality. I would like to start out by having a brief conversation, as always. Um, in this case, I'd like to talk about intelligence and stupidity, because one of the themes in the past few chapters has been that my hero is too dumb to fail, as it were, and too stupid to do the common sense thing. And I know that for me personally, having that sort of self-deprecating view on personal intelligence has been a struggle. It's, it's not perfect by any means. And I know that there are many people, uh, one of my audience members, for, in, for example, uh, that struggle with viewing themselves as unintelligent. There are different measures of intelligence. Sometimes people think they are unintelligent because they don't know something about a certain subject. And that's not the case. You probably know a great many things about a great many subjects that you might not even realize. Intelligence is the capacity to acquire knowledge, to acquire information, in an efficient manner and you can you can exercise that it might not always be easy but anyone can do that if you wanted to learn about cars for instance if you wanted to learn how to fix or maintain your car there are guides there are books, there are videos online. There is that information at your disposal. You can go learn that. But intelligence isn't just about finding the information, it's also about using it. Very, very few people are truly stupid. I'm not saying there aren't any. But for me personally, I've recognize that a measure of stupidity is whether you or not you use and accept the information at your disposal that's readily at hand. If there is an overwhelming amount of evidence towards one particular subject and you are not an expert in that subject, pretending that evidence is irrelevant or false, that is stupidity. On the other hand, if there's an overwhelming amount of evidence, and even if you're not an expert in that subject, you go out and you collect your own evidence to the contrary through neutral, impartial means, that's intelligent. That's, that's very smart. If everyone says the sky is green and you're not an expert in color, for instance, if you go out and you acquire empirical evidence, taking pictures of the sky and asking a large sample size of people what color they see the sky as, and they all say blue. Chances are all that information saying the sky is green is false. I'm getting a little off subject. The point is, you are smarter than you give yourself credit for. You have 
acquired a great deal of knowledge and information about a variety of subjects that you probably don't even realize. Some of it's emotional intelligence, some of it's social intelligence. Some of it's just knowing how to walk around your own house, knowing where to step that's the most comfortable, knowing to avoid places that are less comfortable. It's finding the best sleeping position or the best sitting position. It's arranging your furniture in a way where you can maximize your entertainment and rest values at the same time. Maybe you're really good at cooking. You just know what tastes good to you and you can make things that taste good to you. That's great. You have so much more intelligence than you give yourself credit for. And I hope you continue to pursue that. I hope you don't just embrace, oh, I'm stupid. Uh, no, you're, you're not stupid. You can be stupid if you choose to be, but that would be kind of a stupid choice too. As, uh, as Forrest Gump once said, stupid is as stupid does. And I think he was pretty right about that. <sighs> now, with that out of the way, hopefully you've garnered some information about this. And if you're still questioning your experiences with stupidity, maybe do some research on that. Figure out why you feel stupid. And if it's something you can change, change it. You can do this. Make the smart choice and hydrate. Let's go ahead and take a quick hydration break before we get started. Oh, that's going to be much better. All right. Speaking of stupidity, let's get back into Fable. All right, we had left off having gotten a thing. The Heart of Flames or something. The Fire Heart. Oh, and we had uh, rescued the people from bandits. There were bandits that took people for ransom. Those bandits, they were kind of stupid. That's a troll. Well, let's just let's just be that seems to be like the smart choice. Um What what were we doing? Drowned, ransom victim, ransom victim. That's it. All right, so that's where we're gonna go. We're gonna go to Knothole Glade. That means it's broken because it's not whole. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna try to get some more laughter in these videos. I don't feel like I laugh enough. I make plenty of jokes, but I don't laugh at my own jokes, and that. I want people to understand it's okay to laugh at jokes, especially your own. Laugh at your own jokes. They are hilarious. You are hilarious. Oh, I bet it's that giant quest icon. I bet that's where I'm supposed to be going. Yeah, that seems, that seems likely. Over here. I oh. need to speak to you. All right. Oh. A hero! Oh, at last. A hero at last. It's my youngest son. He's been captured by bandits. I've told him never to go playing in the woods. They say they'll send me his head if I don't pay the ransom. Oh, why does everything happen to me? Why? They're holding him in Could a you cave sound in any Those Filthy savages. You have to rescue him. Here's the ransom gold. If you can kill the lot of them, it's yours to keep. Just make sure my son is unharmed. Oh, I must lie down now in my hut. This is all too much. Hey, over here. What? You seem unusually knowledgeable. Are you some kind of so, traitor? You're off to free my little brother, are you? That's just lovely. Lovely. But you know, my father is a stupid old man. Can you believe he's talking to making the brat the next chief around here? We can't let that happen, my friend. It would be the end of this town. Mm. If you want to make some serious gold, bring the boy to me. I'll be waiting for you 
on the secluded path on the opposite side to the demon door. You seem evil. Don't think we'll be doing that. That that just seems wrong. And arguably stupid. I'm uh I'm not sure how I feel about any of these folks reaction to this situation. I, I mean, I guess call the authorities. I am the authorities, apparently. Ah, oh, forgot how much I hate walking. Which wood lake? That wood lake. A lake of wood? That's just silly. <laughs> Hey, look, a bell ring. A pair of bell rings. Stop blocking. Just, yeah, there you go. Go thump. And more bell rings. <sighs> Boy, they take a long time to die. Just inconvenient. Seems unlikely. <laughs> Boy, that guy is just is dead set on heading for certain death. <laughs> Dumb ways to die. Oh, if you haven't checked out that song. And the message is important as well. Hey, that is something that is stupid. If you play on train tracks, no situational awareness. Trains can't go around you, as it turns out. If, if they're if they're on the tracks, that's that's where they're gonna be. That's kind of how they work. So, yeah, don't, uh, don't try to cross tracks if, if there's, you know, crossing arm, whatnot. Don't try to jump from one side to the other. Why are there bugs in the temple? That's just wrong. relaxing if you can manipulate the flow of time. Just really, really savor it, you know? Without worrying about little things like violence, being attacked by werewolves. Sorry, balverines. Can't call them werewolves. Copyright infringement. I'm guessing. Or maybe uh, there'll be some Maybe there will be some undead that we can call walkers or the biters or I don't know. Uh, anything other than zombies. You heroes always have to stick your nose into everything, don't you? Yes. Well, as long as you've got the gold, the boss won't mind. Go right in. Don't get any bright ideas, though. We'll be waiting right here. Hmm. I've got a bright idea. Yeah, 
Hey, I had a bright idea. And it worked. That's how we do it. Hey, what's the big idea? Attacking my people. The ransom just went up. Now hand the gold over. Any more of your funny stuff and a kid leaves in pieces. Mm. First you attack my boys, and now you won't pay. Oh, I guess you won't mind if we spill the kid's guts out then. Yep, that's the way it's gonna be. I don't think you're gonna do much about it either. Wow, a real hero. And you saved me. Sure did. I can't believe how lucky I am. Bandits and a hero in one day. I suppose we should I get mean, going then. Technically. That man right. you killed is starting to smell funny. They don't decompose I that bet fast. We see more bandits though, and they won't be happy you killed their boss. Hmm. <laughs> I'm starting to regret this choice. Ah. <sighs> All right. We can do this. It's fine. And if nothing else, I can always heal him. It's fine. I've got magic. Oh, the light's hurting my eyes. I'm not missing anything, am I? Nope. Sure aren't. Not a thing. Looks exciting. Yep, sure is. Very exciting. I'll tell you all about it when you're older. to see those mysterious stones. Oh, fine. We can go see the stones. Let's try to avoid shooting you in the face. They're, they're really not that exciting, though. Wait, what do you mean? You, how did you not see them? They had to use them to get in the gate. sounds really, really grown up when he's cheering for me. Aren't these stones the coolest? Shame they don't do much. <sighs> yeah, I guess they don't anymore. Back in my day, they did. We used them to make naughty words and thought it was hilarious. Alright. Hey, you want these gloves as a memento? Are Which we is going to be home soon? Spelled with an E? M E M E N T O. I Not moment. Yep. Not gonna lie, kid. This is uh, kind of inconvenient. No, oh, hey, there's a bandit right there. Remember, kids, it's important to train your bandits so that they will listen and follow commands. You don't want them just running willy-nilly through the, through the woods. Or William-nilly, for that matter. 
just really only call him Willie to his to his friends. <laughs> I will say that these are pretty tough bandits because they take two arrows, whereas the you know, Wolverine, Bal Balverine's, Balverine's, that's the word, they take one. But these bandits take so many. I'm glad I don't have to keep track of arrows. <sighs> All right. Clear. Oh, okay. Well, that one only took one. That was nice. Maybe I got a lucky shot. Or maybe he was just, you know, having an off day. That happens to all of us sometimes, I think. We have off days, and some legendary hero walks up to us and shoots us with a bow made by the god of evil, darkness. Haven't we all been there? <laughs> oh, man. I've had days like that. It's like, ugh so hard to get out of bed because you've been shot by a legendary hero. Avoid that whenever possible. Nearly home now. My friends are going to be so jealous. Your friends sound dumb. Oh, okay. Because that could take the kid to his brother who is that way. A demon who sells doors. How much? I would like to buy one. <laughs> Look at all these people in love with me. Just because they have heard about me. We are. Hey, look, it's your dad. Oh, my dear boy, you're safe. I was so worried. It was brilliant, Father. I was in this cave, and there were all these bandits with these big swords, and then... Stop, stop. It all sounds so horrible. You're never leaving my sight again. I oh, don't Father, remember you being such you a... You never let me do anything fun. Can I at least get a pet Balverine, please? A Balverine? I'm all helpers. We'll talk about it later. Hey, we also need to have Once again, our town conversation fetch. about I just hope the I other never son. Have to call on your services again. It's a terrible strain on my nerves. I hope you can come and kill bandits every day. Y yes. Yeah, we should. What? My son did what? Yeah. Uh, okay. I... He... Alright. You gonna do anything about that? Alright. My son was plotting to kill his brother. Uh oh. He just walks away. Alright. <laughs> feel like that's how that conversation would actually go, but okay. As you wish. Place the fire heart in the hook coast light. I guess we'll go do that then. You know what else we're going to do? We're going to check how long it's been, and then we're subsequently going to set a timer for the remaining time we have. Wouldn't that be clever? 
I do I need to set an alarm for whenever I'm recording to I I don't know. I don't know what it's gonna take for me to start remembering this stuff. It's okay. We've got a timer set now. Oh <sighs> Alright. Back to the game. There we go. Okay. I seem like I'm glancing off the sides, it's because my, uh, one of my puppies is being ornery. I think she wants to go somewhere, but she hasn't used her word to indicate that, so I guess she'll have to wait. That happens sometimes. Buying things just to max them out. There's no reason not to. Guildmaster, a powerful man. With a powerful plan. To make a powerful canal. In powerful Panama. Expecting you. And as you can see, the town's been evacuated, just like the guildmaster asked. Must be something serious, eh? Well, it wasn't easy getting everyone out on such short notice, but as guards know our duty. Do oh, you? I could tell you some stories I could. Please but, don't. Sir, you probably don't want to hear them right now. I'll just leave it to you, sir. Good day. All right. Well. With everybody out of the town, it would be a shame if... I don't know. Anything were to happen to all these shops. <gasps> Are you... Can I not... Ah... Lockpick. Let's assign that to there. Nope, that's not what we want. I'm pressing the wrong buttons. It's fine. No, no, you don't understand. I'm allowed to do this. Maybe I'm not. I don't know. I. No connecting door doorways there. I I just want to give compliments to whoever made these doors. They are apparently indestructible. All right, fine. Back on the tracks. Hey, a silver key. Gonna need a lot of those. Okay. The fire heart. Ah! Ow! Is the fire heart in place. Good. Meet me downstairs. Ah. <sighs> According to the books, the oh, ship should goodness. arrive as soon as the heart's energy reaches full power. Summoner, it's trying to destroy the heart. We have to, we have to protect it. The summoner? That seems counterintuitive. Come on, we have to stop it before it destroys. Oh, that's not what I meant to. D nope, stop doing that. Oh, actually, you know what? Hold on, I forgot. I have a spell. Um, skills. That's magic. Multi arrow assign. Two. Here. Yeah. Ha! 
Yeah, there we go. That's a lot faster. More summoners. The heart needs more time to power up. Come on. All right. I should have done this the whole time. The fire hub must be protected. We've got company. Time to get busy. Nope, nope, nope. that's not who I'm one. That's who I'm one. Let's just take care of that. I like having lots of arrows. Makes this a lot more fun. <gasps> My dog used a word. I I have I have to go. I'll, I'll be right back. Ah, t good word. I'll be right back. Ah, yeah. Uh, cutscene. Hold on. Just say yes. You did good. Good girl. Very good girl. Good girl. Yes. Yes, good word. Good word. Ah! Well, here's your ride. Looks, uh, cozy. When you get to the Northern Waste, okay. your guild seal will activate the local teleporters, and I'll be able to join you. Scythe would have done it Oh, long my ago, goodness. He destroyed Stop seal talking. Arrived. Didn't want Maze to know what he was up to, I guess. Well, have a nice trip. Maybe when I see you next, we can have a snowball fight. Okay, that's great. The strange, silent ship set sail into the featureless okay. swell. Enjoy day this after day, scene. it I carved watch its it path later. among the waves. An ocean phantom moving ever forward. Then the moment came when icy peaks speared out of the horizon mist. These were the shores of the Lost Bay. The northern wastes lay beyond them. Okay, quest completed. Awesome. Okay, so that was fun. That was exciting. I'm back. Uh, I might have to edit this part out. That's fine. It's fine. Uh, cool. <gasps> lost bay. I lost my bay. <sighs> I got a beard? What? No, I always I win. Am Scythe, though my name has long been forgotten in the guild. Maze saw to that. Are you a vampire? My apologies for not meeting you in person. I must remain in Snowspire Village and protect it from summoners. Terrible though they are, they are but a symptom of a much greater power rising in these lands. Big Pharma. Meet me in Snowspire in the far north. I will explain everything. And then we must consult the town's ancient oracle. Because that new oracle is just we can terrible service. And that it holds the answers we seek. Have you been to the new oracle lately? Uh, it's such a hipster place. 
there are like to find the answers you seek you must look within yourself hey, the teleporters are up and running nice one i'm going to have a look around after speaking to Sai. catch you later <sighs> i was doing a bit Very inconvenient. Commemorates this ancient soldiers of Archon who died defending the city from sea invaders. And B list movies. I was going to go open the. Bandit camp thingy. It's a way to the band camp. Twin Blades camp. That's the one. So I feel like if I put on shiny armor, then he'll open up. Yeah. Because he's like, where's my shining knight? One was a gallant knight, then there was an evil, the last, where is... Where's the gallant knight? I'm right here. Um... Nope, that's not, there we go. Plate mail, bright plate mail suit. I only have pants and shoes. I should probably get, where would I get that? Hmm. Maybe in Hook Coast? I don't know. We'll find out. Is there anybody here anymore? Like, we cleared out the town. Oh, yeah, there's people here again. Excellent. It is night time. Of course it's night time. It's always night time and always raining. Just like when my brother hosts a <laughs> Minecraft server. Yeah, sure. Let's just make it daytime. Done. Cool. Alright, are you? Reaper? You nick stuff in my books that makes you a thief. Uh, sorry. Hold on. I can actually do that. Alignment. The legendary Reaper. <laughs> um, there it is. Apologize. Yeah, I'll, I'll hand over gold. Hello, sorry. Reaper. Yeah, I didn't on, know mate, it was stealing. I mean, it just didn't belong to me, and it was sitting there. How was I supposed to know that's theft? Hey, do you Reaper. have greeting right plate man? I'm pleased to serve you. No. Where am I supposed Teresa to Teresa owes her life to you. Do you don't talk about my sister? Dude. Weird. Come on. Mm, maybe not whole glade? I don't know. I don't know. I know, we're getting off we're getting off the main the main path. It's okay. I'm allowed to do this. I'm a hero. Hey, do you have do you have bright plate mail? Well, you think we can do a special offer for you, sir. You a can nope. Heroes. Never mind. Oakvale? Would Oakvale have it? I don't think so. Their economy is not that great. I genuinely don't know where I would find this. Okay, if if you're not following along, 
Um, I am trying to find a bright plate mail chest piece. Your tr I'm pleased to serve you. Teresa owes her life to you. Yes, she does. Trespassing really isn't allowed here. And you mean trespass? These people are just finicky. It's just blah. This might be another one of those times I have to look something up. I don't want to, but I might have to. can I do you for? I think we can do a special offer for you, sir. Why, you little scroat. <coughs> I, shall do you for them. I don't like people calling me that. It's just, it's rude. It's rude and I'm not going to tolerate it anymore. I deserve better. If that's what they're going to call anybody who does, like, window shopping, like, just unacceptable. They need to get a better shopkeeper. I'm just going to say it. He needed to work on his customer service skills, especially when dealing with somebody like me. A violent, dangerous sociopath. Oh. That's a big chunk of ice. Don't say. Ow. Ow, ow, ow. Well, that was rude. Ow. Ow! I killed you! Stop exploding! Diamonds. I thought there was a way you could have more than one spell ready. Creatures in the north. Ice troll. Great. Saw that. Yeah, whatever. I don't feel like sitting and reading through the stuff. Reading is for nerds. I'm a nerd, it's okay. Sometimes I read. Don't feel like reading right now. Multi-arrow is really the way to go with this. I should have been doing this the whole time. But now I know, and it's okay. Today's map letter is D. In game. In game. 
I need to trim my scruff in real life, but that's okay. I okay, there we go. I was gonna say I can't go up this very basic, straightforward path, apparently. Hmm. Uh, apparently this is a restricted area. Nope, can't pick it. Alright, well, I tried. I guess I will go elsewhere. Maybe I'll follow the giant blinking yellow icon on the map. I guess. The electric teleporter. That's him. They look a dead end. That's also handy, but for different reasons. <gasps> it has a treasure chest. The real dead end was the treasure we made along the way. Welcome's Club? What? Diminutive warrior shunned society and lived in the mountains. Sometimes laughed as they saw a small form trudging towards them with his club in hand. Usually the last thing they did. That's the last thing I would do. Charge at someone. Because it involves movement. I'm lazy. So very lazy. I mean, you, you all know how I feel about walking. Hey, look. What you want to bet? It's a fishing spot. There we go. Now it's going to let me fish. riveting gameplay. Oh, goodness. This is a hefty fish. I don't think it's a fish. I think it's stuff. It's just like fishing in real life. In real life. Get it? Because you reel in a fish. We got it! Haha! Like it. Elixir of life! Nice. That's a potion that makes my life better. In fact, let's go ahead and use some of those potions now. Elixir of life. I would prefer it not kick me out of that, but alright. And now, I should have more health and magic. Magical health! Hey lady, are you lost? There you are. So how was the cruise? Why, why didn't we just... <laughs> Me? Yeah. I'm more of a teleporter girl. Yeah. Good Lazy thing your seal dog. set the local ones off. I've managed to get a good look around and this pile of stones might be worth investigating. See all those inscriptions? I'm heading back to the guild to work on the translations. Yeah, you be shame if you did any actual spires. hero Speak work. Side. He's waiting for you. Catch you later. Is Snowspire a town? Like. Alright, fine. Side path to a lake. <gasps> I bet there's more fishing to be had. Yeah, fishing. Yeah. I may as well. It's relaxing. It's kind of soothing. It's kind of... Oh, goodness. It's lots of tapping buttons. Over and over and over. Not buttons. One. One button. Okay, there we go. Ha-ha! Just let me use it. Ah, oh, fine. Items. Potions. 
will master six legs or use. Yeah. I have lots of will. Snowspire Village. Nice. Mm -hmm. <gasps> Scythe. Welcome to Snowspire, hero. Walk with me. Speak of your journey. I don't really do that. Speak. No, I just gesture Summoners kind of have reached nonchalantly. Then there is less time than I thought, and I have much to tell you. I arrived here and he's many going to die. years ago, when the guild believed Jack of Blades would use the Snowspire Oracle in his search for the sword. Are you got like a Sean now Connery voice it going is on? We are in need of its wisdom. To speak with it, we will need the glyphs of inquiry. They were hidden in the age of Archon by They're basically just like Better questions on the pieces of paper. Necropolis. I will send word to the Necropolis guards to grant you passage. Really, we could use anything, but this seemed like the most complicated way of doing it, so that's the way we're going to do it. That we that's how we do things here. Complicatedly. Hey look, a house I can buy. Yeah. No. Yeah. 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 I have a really nice house here. Took me like 10 minutes. And more money than most people see their entire lives. You can get a lot done with that as your standard. Just using... A new guard model. Here, kind, that is probably the most exciting thing about this place. New guard models. Let's sleep. Because I want to go shopping. And apparently they won't let you do that unless it's daytime. No 24-hour blacksmiths here. Got to wait for Fable 2 for that. Hello, you. Reaper. Uh, hi. What yes. do you think we can Love do a special trade. offer for you, sir? Master stuff. You got weapons? Do you have, uh. armor? No. You got weapons and augmentations. Really was hoping for armor. All right. Well, I can't believe it. After centuries, the northern wastes are open again. You can't believe that the northern wastes where you live are open again. <laughs> yeah, you drop your wood. It's fine. It's fine. Ch charity you worker. Must be Rick. I'm pleased to serve you. You Teresa survived thanks to you. This place needs I don't know, like a giant influx of economy or something? I don't know. I gotta say, I'm I'm kinda disappointed. Nice I came here for one thing. I really was just coming for clothes. Oh sir. Taylor, yes. No, not trying to grab your stuff, J trying to talk to you. There we go. A redhead wig. Okay. <gasps> Bright plates, chest piece! Got it. Look at the redhead wig tick. Red plate guns. They have everything I need. Especially a redhead wig. I don't know how I'll have red hair otherwise. Just no, no idea. But now, now, oh, now, we're gonna go open a door. It's gonna be amazing. I think that would probably be our last act. Yes, we're going to open a door and it's going to be amazing. It's gonna be horrendously disappointing, I'm sure. 
but we're going to do it anyway. Very excited. Yes, I know it's time. I know. I set the timer. But I did not set the deputy. Okay. So, here's what we do. We're here now. So now we go over to clothing. We go over to full suits. We go down to bright plate mail suit. Where? Huh? One was a gallant, then there was the last. Ah, there I recognize go. you, the, the gallant, gallant knight. knight. Where is the evil mage I await? It just seems like a weird party. Gallant knight, evil mage, you know? Bandit? That will be Dark Will Use Your Suit. Yeah, there we go. I recognize you, the evil mage. Where is the mischievous bandit I await? Uh, I killed most of I mean, uh, let me put on a different pair of pants. I recognize you, the mischievous bandit, my friends. Welcome. You have weird friends. Just weird, weird friends. And now, now we put back on our actual outfit. see what is inside the bitter shrine the dull master's mace fingers and an eye for detail were placed where the dull master's trademarks building wants to use his skills to create a weapon as a result as colossal as his dolls were delicate huh Well, it's kind of like the end scene of that one uh, Marvel movie. It's like, so, didn't get what you were expecting. Maybe you were uh, disappointed. Things didn't turn out quite how you wanted them to. But sometimes that's the way life goes. You wait for something and uh, just kind of disappoints you. Maybe this is all you really needed, though. Maybe this is all you wanted. It's been a wild time, my friends. Thank you so much for joining us. And remember, you are very, very clever. Far more clever than you credit yourself for. You are doing a lot, and you have a lot to think about. So give yourself time to think. Take some time, give these things some thought, and I'll see you again next time. For now, farewell.